We have eight different type of vegetables that we can grow in water. Last time we were growing garlic, onion in water, which grew very well. So this time we want to experiment with different types of vegetable again. So we have carrot here, romaine lettuce, pok choy, turnip, beet, all the beets here, celery, red lettuce, and leek. I want to cut the bottom part and rest I'm going to make delicious vegetable dish from all of this. So let's start with celery. So I want to cut right here. And by the way, this is I have here, I filled water a little bit, refrigerator drawer. I'm reusing it, we had an old refrigerator. All right, so I'm going to cut. After I cut, I'm just going to put right here. That's it. And then I'm going to put right there. And same thing here, I'm going to cut, put here, like this. Uh, and then this is romaine lettuce, same thing with this romaine lettuce, I'm going to put right there. And a leek, this way right here, this one easy cut. And this one here. I have some box soy, five box soy here, which I want to use. And then all of them I'm going to put in a while. Well, right here. Okay, then this one right there. So I cut on the bottom part. I'm going to use right here to remove some water from there. Uh, this looks like a little bit more water I have. So now, carrot. I want to just keep it right here and then right here. Okay, Look. floating uh, right here. Same thing with this. Again, it will float. I know. Okay. Uh -huh. We have turnip, so turnip is, let me cut this purple part. Yeah, oh wow, too big. And then put the turnip here. Now we have beet. So beet, I just simply cut here. Hmm, wow. Uh, I didn't make the, all that colorful water right there because of beet. And let me cut this guy. Beautiful here. Finally, the last part a bit. So eight different type of vegetables. And as I said, I want to remove this water a little bit. It looks like uh, I have too much water here. Let me simply throw this water. <laughs> so I'm putting here on my porch, this all this eight different type of vegetables and I will keep checking to see how they are doing and then I can also put in inside since this is springtime I'm putting outdoor and it will do well but in the winter we can put on the window where it gets indirect sunlight or direct sunlight it would also be fine but now let me keep here and then there will be Good. Let's see. I'll be keep checking. I put all these vegetables, eight type of vegetables, three days ago, and then already I see new growth here in the water. For example, this has a new growth right there. Only three days. But I don't want to put outside. I want to experiment inside. So I brought them inside, and I want to put in this two pot, beautiful pot I have. For that, I want to put a little bit of water. This way, not much. Um, I need to change every other day. I want to change the water. I don't want to put water sitting in the pot. So let me put right here this one and all the celery, bok choy, romaine lettuce, and 
and this is lick. So okay. this is one of, these? one of the highlight. Okay, right here. So, so all the base is sitting in the water. Not much water. Let me put a little bit more water here. I think this will be enough. And carrot. And carrot right there. Um, and this beet. I see new growth. Beet. And then I put a little bit right here. Okay, sounds good. We'll keep checking. I'm putting indoor right here. These two pot, they are together. One week, some of them kind of rot, but some of them are doing great. And this bucket, but here in this bucket, they are doing pretty good, all of them. Turnip and beets. Alright, one week experiment. So we try to regrow this. Some of the vegetables, they decayed you know, at the bottom. And I can see a little leaves here. Uh, this is a bok choy. And there's another bok choy right here. This is also, well, it's rotting. The base is rotting here. So as you can see, the base is rotting. Same thing here. Another one, the base is rotting. And this is uh, green lettuce. This also, the base is not rotting, but I think that it lacked some water. It's okay, I will, I will still keep it for a few days. And the leek, this leek is really doing great. It has tons of tons of roots there, and it's doing great. And celery, even though it's decaying here, this part is still formed. And I need to add some more water. And this one, this is red lettuce, doing great. It has a foam base. I think if any vegetable has a foam base, it regrows. And one thing I learned from this is that my mistake was I put too much water and it started decaying. And also, if you want to harvest these uh, vegetables, for example, if you want to harvest, it's better to harvest in a, in a week. It's not a good idea to wait for more than two weeks. It will regrow and it's fine. Yeah, it's just, I can use it and uh, I can keep it here. But rest of them and the celery too, I can harvest. Um, that's good. And this guy, I want to let it be. Maybe it's a good idea to harvest this one too. Yeah. Another thing is that when you buy, make sure that the base is a little flat, a little bigger, and it's strong. When I bought this, it was in the refrigerator for maybe for some time. So that is the reason when you bought, if you get a fresh, it the chances of regrowing is very high. Same thing with all the vegetables here. Now, in this bucket. I had, I had turnip, beet, and carrot. Three, one, but it was doing good. But now, it's also start rotting. Because I think I added more water. It started rotting here. It might still go for a few days. Like this one, very squishy. And also here, this is beet, which is really doing good. Still, this is very firm. It's doing really great. So let me harvest here. And also there are other two beads. Let me okay, harvest. I, you can see here so many little sprouts are coming from everywhere. So that is really cool. And this guy right here, same thing with this. Yeah, and this is carrot. Carrot doing great. As you see, there is no sort of you didn't see any root, but it's growing very nice. I want to put it here. 
And this guy. Wow, it looks so good. I already have some vegetables there. So, 